plotting points. Every ordered pair contains an x-coordinate and a y-coordinate. So when we're asked to plot the point 5, 7, that really says the point x equals 5, y equals 7. Our x-axis is the horizontal axis, and our y-axis is the vertical axis. So the point where x equals 5 and y equals 7. Well, x equals 5 here, but also on every point on this vertical line. y equals 5, I'm sorry, y equals 7, on every point on this horizontal line. So the point where they intersect is the point 5, 7. So this point is 5, 7. The point negative 3, 2 is where x is negative 3 and y is positive 2. So the x act, the x coordinate is negative 3, the y coordinate is 2, we intersect those. This is the point negative 3, 2. For negative 8, x is 4, y is negative 8, intersect those. This is the point for negative 8. Negative 9, negative 6. x is negative 9. y is negative 6. Intersect those. Other points can also be defined where one or both of the coordinates is 0. So for example, the point negative 5, 0 says the x-coordinate is negative 5 and the y-coordinate is 0. Well, here's where the y-coordinate is 0. It's tough to see because it overlaps the x-axis. So the point negative 5, 0 is right here. Zero, 4 says the x-coordinate is 0. It's tough to see because it overlaps the y-axis. And the y-coordinate is 4. So there's the point zero, 4. Now, turning the idea around, let's start with some points that have already been plotted and identify the coordinates of each point. Point A has an x-coordinate of negative 5 and a y-coordinate of 3. So its ordered pair is negative 5, 3. Notice how I wrote it with a comma between the x and y coordinates and parentheses surrounding. Point B has an x coordinate of negative 3, 3 and a y coordinate of 0. So its ordered pair is negative 3, 0. Point C has an x-coordinate of 6. Oops, sorry, I was looking at the wrong letter. Point C has an x-coordinate of negative 2 and a y-coordinate of negative 8. Point D has an x-coordinate of 0 and a y-coordinate of 6, so 0, 6. Point E 
has an x coordinate of 6 and a y coordinate of negative 3. So 6, negative 3. And finally, point F has an x coordinate of 7 and a y coordinate of 2. So point F can be defined by 7, 2.